If you need to learn more details about your clip or individual project, say it's metadata or the type of media you're using, there's one key place in LumaFusion that you need to head to, and it's called the Information Panel. When you're inside a project, the Information Panel can be accessed by tapping this info icon at the bottom left of the preview. You can see that if I have a clip selected, the information shown in this summary here will be linked to the clip itself, telling you its name, trimmed length on the timeline and full length when extended, how many frames per second it has, its frame aspect ratio, video codec, colour space and bitrate. If a clip has audio attached, we can see its audio codec, sample rate and whether we're working with stereo or mono audio. Tapping the three dots on the right here will enable you to see the extended metadata of the selected clip, like where it sits in the project, its storage location path, how large it is, and when it was created. You can even see which other projects a clip has been used in. You can also use this information panel to rename your clip, which, if you choose to do so, will show on the clip on the timeline itself. In the information panel, you can also add a colour tag to your clip, by tapping on these small coloured circles. This will alter a clip's colour on the timeline, but rest assured it won't affect the content of the clip at all, but can be a great way to help you organise your shots on the timeline. You can also add notes to individual clips here, which is great for giving yourself little reminders or pointers that you might want to come back to later on. Now, if you don't have a clip selected on the timeline, the information panel will tell you details about your project as a whole, like when it was created, how many clips you're using, and if you scroll down, will even show you a log of completed exports, detailing settings, success status, dates, and destinations. But that's not it for the information panel. Oh no, in fact, it can also help you quickly alter your titles without you having to go back into the editors. If you tap on a title in the timeline like this, by then pressing the info icon and then the three dots to expand the information panel, you can edit the available lines of text, saving you time when making small changes. Exploring the information panel is a great way to not only learn more about your projects and individual clips, but to also expand your technical understanding of metadata and how it can help you in your editing.